completely agree with your point uh, and the chairman's point that visiting the country is so important and being in Kashmir to observe what's happening from a human rights standpoint is essential. Senator Chris Van Hollen from Maryland, uh, he was, I just spoke to him very recently, he was denied entry you know, by the Indian government. USERF has not been allowed. What reason have the Indian government given you for those denials? I think the Indian government in the past has had concerns about uh, some of the issues that have been raised by USERF. Uh, I hope that that is changing. Um, we, we have engaged with Indian gov government officials um, who have been very helpful in understanding some of what is going on uh, in, in, in response to, to, to concerns that we're currently raising. And I hope that that process and, and is one that, that allows us not only to have constructive and positive engagement, but also allows us to go into the country. In the past couple of months, I've had a chance to, to visit Burma and Bangladesh, Iraq and Vietnam, and I can tell you that there is no substitute for the ability to actually hear directly, not only from stakeholders and, and members of communities throughout the country, but also from government officials themselves. Uh, we completely agree. It's absolutely essential that Western diplomats and USERF be able to visit Kashmir. As you pointed out, 